Hi guys, welcome to the channel. Quick general love reading for my friends Gemini, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus. Whenever you watch this, take what resonates and leave what doesn't. If you resonate, let us know. Like, share and subscribe to the channel. Thank you for the support. So guys, let's find out what messages will come through for you. Gemini, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus in the Love Arena. Let's see what we can get for you guys in this quick love reading. Here we go. Flexible energy and by the book. This is quite a combination because the fairy lady with her yoga asana is the proof that it is important to adapt in front of several situations because this ability can make all the difference in order to recognize multiple situations and be ready to recognize the best possible approach for each and every one of them and the by the book energy is indeed about the ability to put in the ideal mindset that can be helpful in order to achieve a particular goal because this is a focused approach able to provide the elements that can be the required ones in order to make the best out of a situation so flexibility yes and the ability to bring to the table the elements that can be important for you in order to achieve something meaningful the values for example that you believe in um, the virtues that you can display with great confidence Let's see what the Tarot has to say about these energies for Gemini, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus. Here we go. Four of Swords. Five of Swords. Page of Pentacles. Justice Energy. Bottom of the deck. So, Balance and Fairness are calling to be restored in a situation that is offering a touch of ego driven energies because the five of swords for me is ego driven it is about someone that wants to have the last word only for the pleasure to do so when in reality it doesn't really matter it seems a situation guys um, that is calling for some of you to uh, truly display your finer qualities about uh, patience and maturity in order to avoid to get caught up in petty fights, meaningless altercations, discussions that uh, are not able to go anywhere. The justice can also be about legal matters in this uh, specific scenario because the unbalanced interactions, five of swords driven, may have brought some of you to recognize that a great deal of attention is required in order to deal with the situation and possibly with the individual involved in the five of swords energy without wasting too many words because with the five of swords words can be um, turned out against the one that uh, may have spoken them 
so silence the communication is not flowing in a an active way it is important to think things straight before you speak the four of swords is about healing introspection um, gaining knowledge that can be also about how to move in a safe way within the interactions that are kept simple page of pentacles between the four pages the page of pentacles for me is the most diligent one he wants to learn 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 things that he didn't know before so that he can raise his level this can be a fine approach channeled by some of you flexible kind of being able to recognize if some uh, petty fight or altercation is coming around and so uh, you embrace a quiet mode allowing uh, things to be smoother to flow in a smoother way the justice can be uh, absolutely uh, legal matters i will pull the justice because bottom of it we have the young man so enlightenment and seeing things in a different perspective being able to see through the ego driven pattern within the five of swords this can be a connection that is destined to uh, to be left behind page of cups wanted to come out king of cups knight of pentacles and we have confusion bottom of the deck five of wands um, a noisy and annoying energy for me um, I usually associate the five of wands to one of the Alicia Keys songs people keep talking they can say what they like this can be the five of swords uh, individual they are unable to deal in a mature way with their feelings because the king of cups is an energy about maturity in the emotional arena in the love arena someone that has understood everything about his feelings and emotions but sometimes for me the king can struggle a little bit with the communication part and with this combination king of cups five of swords the person that some of you are dealing with is not able to understand in the proper way the factors that are truly important when it comes to matters of the heart for this very reason that can uh, even be considered as a, an inner pattern of this individual they they cannot understand how to behave in a mature way when it comes to love and partnerships of course but this is a deal breaker because they are not capable of putting in the required flexibility depending on the situations because they always want to have the last word and they are not able to recognize that some factors by the book energy need to be involved within a love partnership so that the connection can be successful but if these factors are missing the connection uh, cannot work so this person is basically uh, working against the connection but um, the five of swords offers also the opportunity to the people surrounding the man um, 
the chance to remove from the situation, leaving the man behind, stay alone, whatever you say, and talk about the satisfaction then. And this is the point, guys, with this reading. Um, I will be 100% uh, honest with you. It is involved in a confusionary and annoying set of interactions. And uh, it is exhausting. Exhausting. The Page of Cups is the small act of kindness that uh, this person is not uh, able to offer in favor of those of you that may resonate with this uh, reading. You, on the other hand, have embraced uh, an introspection that is crucial in order to guide you through the uh, dealing with this individual until the justice energy has played out completely. You are keeping your interactions simple and casual. Two pages. The Knight of Pentacles is slowly but steadily directed towards a meaningful outcome that can be the opportunity to leave this individual behind. A trustworthy energy, a reliable, honest, sincere. This can be your approach by the book Flexible. The knight is um, able to pay attention to all the details and factors involved in a situation. Uh, is holding the Ace of Pentacles, he is willing to offer it, but the circumstances need to be uh, the right ones. Otherwise, the Ace will stay in his hand. This one can be the slowest of the four knights in the deck, but we know that he will power through the finish line even if he may take a little bit more time than the other knights. So the situation can unfold in your favor, uh, meaning with the chance to leave behind the ego-driven individual. They are not uh, emotionally mature enough and you may have realized that because of the Four of Swords and because of the Hanged Man, so an inner process that we have seen at bottom of the Justice uh, first deck. Seeing things in a different perspective, in a different light, finding enlightenment throughout uh, an uncomfortable position, an uncomfortable situation. This one is an uncomfortable situation, especially considering also the Five of Wands. This person may talk a lot and they are all about their ego. This cannot go anywhere. And so um, it can be it can be the direct consequence that uh, we are moving different and separate ways. The feeling is about the fact that this person is uh, too much caught up in their ego-driven patterns. They are emotionally immature while on the other hand you are more wise and mature than them when it comes to matters of the heart if it was a connection uh, established um, the justice will work as the fair closing point the right outcome it can be a marriage for some of you for others it is just um uh, just a uh, committed uh, being together connection patience the situation will unfold with uh, time but you have the chance to move towards a situation that can vibe along with your uh, by the book values your um, your virtues the things that uh, you believe in so uh, let's see 
where these energies are going guys i will leave it at that for now i truly hope it was helpful i'll continue on vimeo see you there if you want to join me the link is below let us know if you resonate leave a comment like share and subscribe to the channel until next time i wish you the best guys take very good care of you and i will talk to you soon bye